Okay, so here's our next Aliens video game. Alien, Aliens, whatever. It's, uh... So it's a, a marine platoon is returning home to something or other. And there it is. The ship's computer mother picks up distress beacon from the space freighter Thanatos. You get literally just enough time to read that. The mother receives instructions from marine... HQ to set of course wake the marines to something investigate giant freighter. I have to go I have to account for the fucking font as well. I hope you keep that in mind. Cause that looks like a HO. After waking the Marines prepared to dock with the fan toss. It looks like a HO, and it took me a hot second to realise it said HQ because of the font. They guide their ship toward the freighter, ready to investigate. Okay. Well, still images look about as good as what you get for the Game Boy Color, really. The Marines dock with the Thanatos and board the massive vessel. Yeah, we're getting a lot of story here, boys. And there it is. There's the title screen. So that's the game we're playing. Um, the second game. Aliens Thanatos Encounter. Developed by Crawfish Interactive. Published by THQ and released in March 2001. Um... This is a Game Boy Color exclusive Aliens game. I don't know why. Don't ask me. I don't know. The Game Boy Color is like Babby system, so I don't know why they put an Aliens game on there. Just being honest with you, that's the truth though, isn't it? You know, the, ga the Game Boy Color, Game Boy, Game Boy Color is all marketed as being, like, for kids, family friendly, jazz, you know, all that jazz. So to have an Aliens game on this is kind of stupid. I'm just saying. Game Boy Advance is where it started branching out. A little bit, a little bit. You know, you got like, what do you got, like Doom on the Game Boy Advance? Not that you'd want to play that that version of Doom, but you know what I mean, though. That's what I'm, that's what I'm getting at. So, is this gonna be as terrible as Alien Three for the game original Game Boy was? Like, imagine getting that as a kid, Alien Three on the original Game Boy. You'd be fucking disappointed because you'd just be like, as a kid, running around going, "What the fuck am I supposed to be doing?" You're not going to get the manual, are you? You're going to back back when I was a kid. You, you know, you're lucky to get the manual. You're lucky to you get the fucking box. Most of the time, you've got the cart and or just the disc. So that's why I don't ever like read the manual. I don't know if, if anyone ever wonders why I don't like. Oh, you don't read the instructions? Yeah, because I never would have read the instructions as a kid. Never got that mindset. I didn't start having manuals with my video games until the PlayStation Two era. But for for Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, Nintendo 64, PlayStation 1, all of them were mostly just discs, or they came with a jewel case with no manual. All pre-owned games. I didn't have, I didn't, you know, my parents didn't have enough money to buy me brand new fucking games. What are you, fucking high? <coughs> Alright, so we have a couple of characters to pick from. Okay. Why? 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 I don't get this. I never understand the games of games like this giving you the option to pick a character. Who cares? They're all pixel. They're all gonna look pixelated in the same anyway. So who cares? I, I jo Jorel. I pick a Joko Cadet Jorel. Oh, do they all have stats? All right. What's what are their stats? Speed is high. Stamina is high. All right. I want max everything. Stamina's. Average. Oh, that is the character you want. Corporal Brook. Four speed, four stamina. Yeah, we want that. Level one docking bay. This area is where you will set up your command post. Clear the docking bay of any unwanted guests before moving deeper into the ship. End transmission. So there you go. We're starting off by shooting aliens, which is how the game, how Alien 3 should have started. Because no, I'm just saying it should have had a little like this game had exposition, right? Let me just read this. Level point, you will be permitted to leave this area until all the aliens are destroyed and all survivors rescued. That's fine. With say, let's just what I said with Alien Three. Why couldn't they just have the beginning of the movie be like stills and then have the game start where Ripley has a gun and action is happening? But then again, Alien only has one alien, and I saw multiple aliens there, so. Oh yes. Who this is bad?
Oh, is that Survivor? So it's a top-down kind of game. Okay, why is there a ladder there? I don't know, I don't ask questions. Well, these are survivors, by the way. I was shooting him because I thought it was an enemy running around, but no. It was Survivor. And there's apparently a Survivor up here, or something's up here. No, oh, what's that? <coughs> So there's little dots on the mini map on the in the middle. I like I like that there is a kind of mini map. That's fine. But they're just survivors mainly. Just go collect the survivors as they run around like a bunch of idiots. Oh, there's one. Come here. What's that? Oh, I've got I've got the good gun. Or not? I just got more ammo. Oh, alien. Come here. Ah! Ah! They, they move in such weird patterns. Oh, fantastic. They're able to just completely drain my health while I struggle to fucking hit them. Fantastic. I like that. So they're able to drain my health. Oh, he just stuck on me and I just was like getting beaten to shit. Whereas here's me struggling to fucking... Look, that's my, that's how I can attack. And yet they can just, just freaking ram me. And then they move strangely. So you gotta... And, and... That one didn't even hit it! Oh, that was a lucky shot. That was a fluke, that shot. Seriously, though. Seriously. What the fuck? What are you trying to do to me, game? Oh, thanks for the ammo. He's just beating his meat in the corner. <laughs> hey, well, I'm not, that's what he looked like he was doing. I ain't judging. Oh, alien! Ah! 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 Ah, oh, fuck! You see what I mean? They, they do all, all they have to do is touch me. I would prefer if the gun shot from the middle. I know that doesn't make sense. But, at least then I'll fucking hit the alien. Look! The bullet went through the alien. Are you retardo? You saw that. Don't tell me you didn't see that. That, that bullet went through the alien. Aha, got ya. This is retarded. I'm just gonna be telling you as it is. It, this is fucking retarded. Running around like a spastic, shooting your little gun. It's just fucking stupid. Oh, here's a lot of survivors. Be alright if you, but you pick up a random survivor and they give you, like, health or something every now and then. That would be, uh, that'd be nice. There's another one. Also, they run around like a bunch of idiots. Oh, there's a there's a there's a face hugger. See, look, they're, they're so erratic. Ah! What the fuck? The bullet went through again. The bullet went through them again. Go away. Imagine me playing as any other character right now. This is stupid. I'm having to run around like a spastic. And there we go. I'm having to run around like a spastic. To shoot them. Like, if the gun was in the middle, like, just both are... I know they've got equip right and equip left, and I guess you get another fucking... I guess the equip left is the, is the map thing, right? Fine, right? But I'm gonna be honest with you. If I'm, pl not, if I'm playing as Ripley, makes sense. If I'm playing as anyone else, doesn't make sense. Especially if this is a fucking Marine. Because they have that shit built into their helmets. So shut the fuck up. I've seen it in the films. They have it built into their fucking helmets. Don't give me that shit. So I don't even need it taking up a fucking slot in my inventory. Don't even need it being in the left hand. Don't give me that shit. Oh, alien! 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 
This is literally the reaction to every alien that appears. It's just like, ah, alien, quickly run! Oh yes, thank you. These hitboxes for the aliens are fucked. At least they don't eat the survivors, I guess. They're so hard to hit! They are honestly so hard to hit, you just gotta hope that they stop at some point. Oh! Oh! That came out of left fucking field! Marine captured. I went to save the dude, and then that thing came out. And now it's telling me I've got 200 seconds to, to get the Marine. So I guess i got to pick a different a Marine. And I've then I've got to go and save that particular Marine I, I got. Yeah, that's how the game plays. Wow, this is shit. I'm going to just tell you as it is. It's fucking dog shit. Don't get me wrong, it's not as bad as Alien 3, but it's still pretty bad. Again, I'd like to remind you, imagine getting this as a kid. You'd be fucking like, wow, this is dog shit. I would have been as a kid. Wow, this is fucking terrible. you got to realise, right, when I was a kid, I had like five Game Boy games. I played one of them. I played one of them. I played Pokemon. I played Pokemon... I had Pokemon Red. And that's what I played. I had Bart Simpson's Escape from Camp Deadly. Most people would understand. That game is terrible. I had Batman, which I did play on occasion, but not much of. I do regard it as a classic, but I didn't play that much of it. I wasn't very good at it. Never, never, never able to really finish the game. The furthest I got was in the video I did for it on YouTube. Um, I had R-Type... Again, never got far in that game, so just didn't play it. And I had Scooby-Doo Classic Creep Capers, which I just didn't get what I was supposed to do in that game. Again, no manual, no nothing. No internet. So I just played Pokemon. That's all I played. So this is one of those games where I would have had the game. I would have known, understood what I got to do, but I wouldn't have liked the game, and I would just stop playing. That's what happened. I just... I would rather, I ended up, you gotta realise as a kid, I ended up playing through, I ended up like playing through Pokemon, deleting my save file, and then playing through it again, and I did, must have done that who knows how many times. I played Pokemon Red so much, they ended up getting me Pokemon Blue and Pokemon Yellow. That's how much I ended up playing Pokemon Red. Because they were like, wow, you play that one game so much, my parents were like. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I just want to make a point. Just wanted to, 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 to say to you. You know what I mean? It's just, yeah. I'm not going to play any more of this Thanatos encounter. We've got one more game to look at, which was the game that was requested. So, uh, let's have a gander at this last game. Hopefully it'll be uh, better than what we've seen so thus far.